have new access to Lisa, so we put Facebook Live, and Miss Prime who helps us by making our panels. And today at Story Time, we are talking about a creature who lives under the sea. And who could it be? Who can tell me who this is? It's a shark. His 
friends all around him seemed to shrink back too. Mr. Fish's face fizzled. Oh, I don't know what to do. Shark acted badly, and being mean is wrong. But I'm just one fish. Am I really that strong? What do you guys think? Do you think that Mr. Fish is strong enough to stand up to star? No, you don't think so? Not all by himself? I think the shark beat fish. Yeah. He turned to leave the park, feeling sad through and through. Then slowly came a thought. There is something he could do. Words could make a difference when things go wrong. Yes, he thought, I'm just one fish, but my voice is strong. Mr. Fish turned back and directly faced the shark. It was time to talk straight about what happened in the park. Mr. Shark said, Mr. Fish, you have broken up our fun. Bully isn't who you are, but it is what you have done. The things you did were me, and that's not what we expect. So please leave until you're ready to treat us with respect. As Mr. Fish spoke up and his words rang out loud, the friends all around him formed an upstanding crowd. Together they were stronger, now none of them were scared. They cared about each other and the ocean world they shared. Soon Mr. Fish was laughing and his friends were having fun, taking turns and music and empathy, each and every one. Mr. Shark down here in the corner is reading a book about how to be nicer to his friends. The park filled again with joyful sounds of play, plus the confidence of knowing how to keep it that way. We are kind, we are fair, we are all potential friends. So we speak up when we need to. And that is how bullying ends. Great job!
book. And this one is called The Three Little Fish and the Big Bad Shark by Julia Fortune. Mommy.
circle. Thank <laughs> you. 
We smile and sing goodbye. With my friends, a story time. We smile and sing goodbye.